All right, chapter 10, page 275, there's a, a section on teacher tenure. Um, this is part of what's been on the table as a source of, uh, of disagreement, uh, a little anger on the teacher's part because tenure is being changed. Um, tenure laws are intended to provide security for teachers in their positions and to prevent removal of, of capable teachers. Uh, because of actions or political motives or whatever, you just can't you can't decide I'm through with you and be done. That's what tenure was set up to do is is to protect us. Uh, I've never really been concerned with tenure. Um, I've been tenured twice and uh, at being stationed, had just gotten it and then went home and stayed home with Daniel and the girls, and so I lost it. Uh, started in Hamlin County. Um, got to tenure uh, year and actually left your tenure at that time your tenure year started the first day of your fourth year uh, and I actually left to come here to Walter State in the summer so I never got to start that first day so I got it but I never got to reap the benefits of having it um, the tenure doesn't bother me I, I'm not on tenure track here no one's ever offered me tenure here uh, but I can say I'm not uh, very concerned about it. I feel like if I come in and do what I'm supposed to do, they're not going to get rid of you if you do what you're supposed to do, bottom line. Now, I do know there's some folks out there that um, could use their position um, and, and do some um, under-the-table type things, but I can also say I've never been in that situation. Um, and and I, I, this has been a source of frustration for teachers because it feels like that we have no uh, we have no powers staying powers because they they're, they're moving the tenure out further. I think now it's five years. You have to work five years before you can even um, talk about getting tenure, and you have to score so high on the, your evaluations to even be considered for tenure. You have to, as as some of my teacher friend call it, uh, be Jesus walking on the water. Um, Beginning teachers are not automatically tenured. Instead, a teacher becomes tenured by serving satisfactory for a stated time. And I want to think it's all threes and fours uh, on your valuations in order to get to go to the tenure status. Uh, this period is referred to as a probationary period and typically is two to three years. It is now five years due to the Common Core situation. So. Um, I don't want you to get too caught up in are you do you have it do you not have it uh, I want it I deserve it and listening to that in, in the teachers lounge if you're in there and I've told you thousands of times don't be in the teachers lounge um, but don't get too riled up keep in mind you are secure if you if you do what you're supposed to be doing you're secure um, so I, I I don't worry I remember when I got tenure the second time there were about four of us that got it all in the same year we were all hired at the same time and uh, when I went out to load the the kids uh, for bus duty one of the ones that had gotten the tenure uh, she says oh Miss Smith now we don't have to now we can just be ourselves and I didn't know what that meant I said pardon me she said we got tenure uh, so now we can be ourselves now we can say no and we don't have to do we're not doing this and we're not doing that we can just go back to being normal well this hasn't changed anything about getting tenure doesn't change what I do and how I do it and who I am. Uh, I'm not going to perform for you till I get tenure and then go, go south. Uh, what you see is what you're going to get. So I hope you go into it that mentality. Tenure, that's fine. If, you know, if, they, if you get there, that's, that's great. Take it small. Be thankful. Uh, but don't let it change who you are or what you do. Uh, my advice, take it for what it's worth.